Okay, so today we're going to be chatting about top quality ammo, all different types. Okay, so the guns we've got um, are weapons. We've got lots of different types, using lots of different types of um, ammunition. So, this one here, um, this is a railway rifle, and this uses the railway spikes. Uh, lightning bug over there. Then we've got plasmas. Um, so this is a plasma weapon. And then we've got bone arrows. And then we've got um, cryolators. Shoot snowballs. Teslas. So we've got lots of different types of ammo. And the way that we get ammo, we can either pick it up or we can craft it. The way to craft it is on the Tinker's workbench. And what we've got here, we've got ammo, energy ammo, and explosive ammo. So the first lot is your ballistic ammo. 308s, 38s, 44s, 45s, 50 cal even. So what you're going to need uh, to craft these, if you can see on your right hand side you've got gunpowder, lead and steel. You're going to need them in your junk. Um, your junk, you got your scrap box, you can see I've got plenty of junk in there, got everything you would need. Or you'd have if you haven't got Fallout first, you have a stash box and you would carry your junk in there as well. Um, then you've got your, the junk which you would carry um, day to day. Okay, so you're going to need your junk in order to craft. Now, the different types of Ammunition need different types of scrap. You can see on the right hand side lead and steel for the 2mm electron magnetic cartridges, alien blaster, fire cells, fuel. Some of the um, scrap components like oil, um, you've got lack of oil in the wasteland, you haven't got much crystal in the wasteland, copper, you haven't got much of. Okay, so what you're going to need to do when you are crafting is use a few perk cards you've got under agility you've got a perk card here called Am uh, Smith, and that one produces 40% or 80% more rounds so I'll just sit, switch that on now and then you've also got um, another perk card which would double up anything you're going to make. So I'll just get to that one, which is called Super Duper. So if I'm going to craft anything, there's a 30% chance you get double results. You don't always get it, but uh, sometimes you do, which is quite quite nice. And then we also have a legendary card, actually a perk. Um, and this one is called Ammo Factory, and that one produces 150% more rounds when crafting ammunition once you get all the four stars. Um, it's pretty easy and straightforward then. Go to your workbench, choose the ammo you want, and then press build, select your quantity, and go right up or down. This, at the moment, there I can select 255. That's because I do have enough um, junk to have, uh, to basically build as, as many as I want. It goes up to 255. That's your sort of your, your maximum. If I haven't got a particular um, item in my junk, then it will li limit you at this point. 
So for example, I might have less oil, um, so it wouldn't allow me to go further up. Okay, so it's pretty straightforward. Just trying to see if I've got anything yet. All right, okay, plasma core. So I've got nuclear material 142, so it should limit me out. Yeah, there we are, let's look. So the most I can make is 47. As you can see on the others, because I've, I've got all the junk on there, it'll allow me up to do 55. Okay, that's not, that actually max out. So it's pretty straightforward. You need junk in order to um, make your ammunition and the perk cards. Make sure you've got them perk cards. Ammo Smith, super duper. And if you've got legend, the access to the legendary, then use Ammo Factory. Okay, so that's how to craft it. The other ways of um, getting ammunition is go to vendors. Uh, your vendors are found in your railway stations. You will be overpriced on them. You've also got um, other players' vendors. Uh, if I just see that one, he hasn't got any um, ammunition. I have, if you have a look on there, you can see it says ammo 1128, so I've got ammunition there. Um, and you've also got, that guy hasn't got any. And that, oh, that one's got 3596. So you can either get it from um, vendors, other players, or you can get it from railway stations, um, also from White Springs as well um, and also from traveling merchants i just saw one yeah. from a few minutes ago i think he's gone now okay um and the other way to get uh, ammunition is to shoot enemies so let me just change my perks and we'll just go over to Okay, bear a second. What I'm basically doing is use my perk cards to make things lighter. Uh, so I've got through high cap. Okay. 422. Right, okay, so let's just nip over to um, Morgan Town. So in Town we've got some um, Scorched, they usually carry weapons. So once you kill an enemy that has um, a weapon, you should be able to pick up the weapon itself and the ammunition as well. So hopefully we'll see my good out. Looks like somebody else has already been here before. Okay, let's have a look around here. So bear with me. So let's definitely go to um, let's go to the super mutants. West Tech. Okay, so West Tech um, normally our super mutants. They always carry weapons. We should should be able to shoot some of them and get some ammunition from there. Tesla weapon at the moment, uh, that is sort of me chosen weapon, I do like it, um, because you don't have to get on aim, okay, right, so, what you saw then, I just picked up 5mm just then, I also picked up lots of weapons, 
Sharpshooter's Assault Rifle, 556, so I picked up that. You can scrap them down um, for your junk. And you can also get the ammunition that way. So, pretty straightforward. If you're going killing, you're going to get ammunition that way. If you're not killing, you can craft. You can see there, caps, fusion cells. If I'm shooting with a Tesla weapon, which uses fusion cells, okay, you can see cell there. So I use fusion cells, I've got 96,512. And if I shoot somebody or an enemy with that, I'm then going to pick up fusion cells. Now that's a little bit different if, see this one as well, that's just gunpowder. Because they've got guns. If I use. There we are, plasma cutter. Okay, so this is a melee weapon, so this doesn't use any ammunition. If I kill uh, an enemy with this, it'll just drop any ammunition. So that doesn't determine um, what ammunition I get. Okay, so. drop fusion cells even though I was using a melee weapon so what basically happens is um, the the ammunition dropped from an enemy if they've got um, a charging laser sniper rifle so I'll just take that then that contains fusion cells so Charging laser. Right, okay, you can see that one. That's charging laser sniper rifle. That has cells. That just happens to be the same as the Tesla which had anyway. So that's determined to what ammunition I would actually get um, once I kill them. So, ammunition. It's everywhere. You can craft it. You can see there. 556. That's just on the floor. So, somebody just had that. So I can pick it up. Or I can craft it at my base or anywhere that has a Tinker's workbench. Or I can pick it up from an enemy. Or I can get it from um, vendors. Or I can get it from um, other players. So, railway stations, got vendors in, pay for it. I can get it from other players. Or I can craft it at a workbench at my camp if I've got it or I can pick them up. So that's ammunition in a nutshell.